What are you doing, Josh? I don't know, making a video for that. Working. Trying to uh, fix this York rake on my buddy's um, machine. Got my buddy's uh, L2650 Kubota. And in the midst of the spring rush, I mean, I don't know if you guys can tell, I got four or five pieces of equipment here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten behind the gate. One on the thing. Had to do deliveries and returns. I'm going crazy. And a that. pickup. And a pickup. Yeah, I dropped two off earlier. Going a little nuts. We're starting to get busy again. Um, but anyways, this has got a. Uh, hey, how you doing? Wave once in a while, I'm a prick. <laughs> what? I hate it when people drive by and just stare. You know, well, just we, wait. We get a lot of that. High. Drop off a coffee. Anyways, speaking of coffees, I miss Bob. Bob Robinson is a great customer. Look at me being all safe today. Yeah, yeah. No, just give him an update on the phone. It's pretty cool, huh? It's gross and it's yeah. not healing. Yeah, and it's opening back <laughs> up again. It's like, a, it's like, hi guys. Stop it. Don't do stupid stuff without gloves on. Stop it. It's so good to see you. Go away. Thanks for viewing again. My God. Well, anyways, what, you told me to be more myself. I might as well, right? I get it, but like, you don't have to do that to me. Done with my ass like the East Ventura. Hey. Hi guys! <laughs> We're fixing a tractor today! <laughs> I hope they use that picture as a thumbnail. So it broke the center bolt off inside it, and I was thinking about cutting this plate off, drilling it out, and then putting a the bolt in from the bottom, but then I got to thinking and looking, there seemed to be the same thread. So I got my little uh, stainless table going on here. I'm gonna pop this out. And this has got a lift jack on it, so I got it jacked up pretty good. I'm gonna try to get this. Uh... Oh, look at the blood on my TIG glove. I'm falling apart. I need to hit the fucking lottery. Alright, so if we lower this bad boy, you can probably see. Take the brakes off it. That's where the rest of the bolt was. Deep down in that cavern. Get my head out of the way. It's making shadows. Yeah, Let's just stand over way. here in the sun. I'm thinking about trying to either weld on this or do something to try to get that broken bolt out so I can just thread this new one in. I think that would work pretty well. I mean, I, it's worth a shot. It's better than having to cut this bracket off and you know switch the welder over from TIG to the MIG one on the top. I mean, I could take it, but I'd be there forever. Spring wash. Oh man, that thing's pretty crusty. You know what I should do? I should try this. I'll drill a hole all the way down in it and tap it for three eighths. And then lock a nut on it. No, that ain't gonna work. Hmm. Either way, I'm gonna have to get some fresh material, so I'll start a pilot hole in it. Get off my glasses. Don't be I don't safe. think you can see much in the garage because it's dark. It will surprise when we show them at the end of the video. Damn. Not like I can't see it on Instagram. Look at me, I'm Mr. Safety. Yay. No, I'm not making fun of mental people. I'm making fun of people with the... <laughs> this. this. She told me to be myself and quit being professional. This is nice. That's who I am. They'll call me a white or right wing extremist after this. <laughs> Got a heart of gold, guys. Don't let them fool you. When I'm an independent, shit cares more about freedom than anything. If you get a chance, get one of these little uh, drill bits here. They got that step jobber. They work pretty good on uneven surfaces. You burn through them pretty quick and, you know. It don't last long. See, this is why I don't wear safety glasses. See? See the foggage? <laughs> Your eyelashes are stuck. <laughs> yeah, because no fucking glasses ever fit me right, so I gotta wear them like this. <laughs> you know? Look at the tubey, it's going away, huh? Yeah. Pretty. Now I'm gonna use that fucking tubey to push on it a little, maybe. Well, this is good news. You don't wanna, this is the way I am here. It's a soft bolt, so maybe 
Just maybe. Can you see the chip? Yeah. And my lovely DeWalt battery that is not impact resistant. <laughs> All right, now that we got a, quite a ways through, let's make sure it's actually going straight. Any major tool manufacturers out there want to send me some real good shit, I'd be happy with it because the wall sucks. Get yourself a magnetic bit, you're good to go there. See? Yeah? No magnetic bit trick. You can just put them all in the driveway. I honestly don't know how it can be magnetized. I'm just being an ass white. <laughs> <laughs> when you're down in a hole, but... Oh, did we make it through it, or... We're gonna the one part of the hardened bolt. Yeah, we won't go any deeper in that drill bit, because it's not a carbide. See, this is why DeWalt sucks. I fucking hate DeWalt. All right, we grab some more drill bits. Back. You see what we're doing here? Well, yeah. Oh, that thing. Looks like toothy, don't it? Don't be mean to tooth. I shouldn't talk. Look my blown out front tooth. My blown out front tooth assist. Let's see if you can it. Right now, people are screaming at their TVs or phones or whatever they're watching us on. Use some lube! <laughs> I was using this for something. And it's just straight 30 weight oil. Here's my machinist neighbor. What's up, buddy? He's the one that built the bushings for the uh, towable backhoe. 20 bucks as I kick this over and have to speed you. <laughs> Take a look at it. 20 bucks as I kick that brick over and we're screwed. See, this is what I don't like the Walt for. I'm gonna smash this thing. That's what's gonna happen? <sighs> Why, dude? Why? <sighs> junk. And this one might not even have a fighting chance either. It's got some shitty edges on it. Of course, when you do that, you change the clutch setting on it. See, if you don't put it too tight, I'm going to smash it. Well, let's go give them an education on how not to sharpen a drill bit. You ready? Well, uh, and that one seemed like it was going to have edges around it. Let's go give them an education on how not to drill. Put your safety googles on. It's a grinder, and it's not like a nuclear bomb. You can just kind of stand over here and do the job. There's other people on there now. He's on the wrong angle. Look, people, these are China freight drill bits. I can't afford good ones. 
Look at that, huh? Probably gonna cut. Not very far. Look, man, it's spraying wrong. I gotta go, go, go. So. Walmart drill. <sighs> Lovely day. Uh huh. What did you say, lady? It's finally nice out. It is. Come on, let's go. I'm in my ADD alone, right? Spill it, but there's stalactites growing in there. Yeah. Check it out. If, look, if you can get a good shot, get a good shot down there. Yeah. Maybe that's water. Yeah. Got a little bottom of that. Yeah. It's good cutting fluid. Always get some on your driveway. Drill bit's making that noise. Just do that a few times. Okay, now it's getting to the hardened. Watch your foot. Um, okay. Now we get the fire on it. So what you do is, is you put, hmm, which way is the wind blowing? Going this way, so put the fire in the hole from this side. Burn up all our tools. Sounds about right. Just to get that warm. Gee, if I had a workbench out here, it'd be amazing, wouldn't it? You are, you're you're definitely you are gonna spill this. Huh? <laughs> you were 100 percent itching to spill that. I said you were 100 percent itching to spill that oil. Over there, next to my schmigarette. Beautiful. Work. I think we gotta invest in TIG gloves because these are only a couple few days old. Throw the body dust on them. I'm a mess, people, but <sighs> I'm only a man. One man, too. That is all of it. I only need some of it.
I got it. After much grinding, maybe you can see it better in the sun, drilling and just getting really agitated. That was tack welded on the back of the bracket, so I just took a sledgehammer and pounded it. So let me throw this back together real quick and uh, we'll go do a job with it. friend of mine's tractor we trade work off so i was that's why i was able to go test it and use uh use it to go level out some dirt that i had put down at the neighbor's house guys <laughs> we're in the middle of trying to shoot an outro here and you're running your mouth you don't know any better I know. shut the hole <laughs> there's man's fingernail in the video too no it's not it's close it's on Eagle. Hmm? It's on Pear Eagle. That's great. We're trying to say goodbye to people when we talk about eagles. Well, I'd rather not be saying goodbye to people. I'm beat. Yeah, I'm beat too. I'm whooped. So yeah, you got to see me struggle with that pin and what a freaking nightmare. It was supposed to be a half an hour job turned into an absolute mess. Um, and then I got to level the dirt for the neighbor, which is pretty cool. And like I said, that's, that's a friend of mine's machine. I mean, it's a customer, but... Not really. All right. Till next time. Bye-bye.